My thoughts about this library naturally is all good. In fact, uh, this library is more than just a library to me and to this community. This library is one of our points of pride. It's a facility that we can point to with pride and say that's our library. We can do that because of the appearance, the physical appearance of it, but more important is what's inside of this building that we are so proud of. You know, I go around bragging, I don't know how true it is, but it sounds good, that uh, we have more computers in this library than any other library in the city of Columbus. I don't know how true that is, but it, uh, I don't think we're that far off. And uh, I read something in the paper about the main library having an automatic checkout. We had that from day one. The staff, I can't say enough about them. They're very helpful, very kind. I've watched them and listened to them, and their attitude is, is what's so important. I just, just want to thank the staff. Just want to thank you and thank you on behalf of the community for doing a wonderful job. Columbus Metropolitan Library, this is Michael. May I help you? The call center concept came about to increase some of the efficiencies that we can accomplish with our existing staff to improve consistency and primarily to give our busy branch and division staff more time with their customers that come into the building. We uh, had a task force made up of people from all over the system, um, from the branches and main library, from different departments, and they did a lot of research and study to help bring about the end result. We've gotten a lot of positive feedback uh, from staff. Uh, most locations at, at this point are rolled into our call center and they send us emails and post up on CMLSI. What a difference it's made. The phones are much quieter and they have much more time with their customers in the building. I just want to say a very heartfelt thank you to all the staff that work the call center and all the staff that may not work here but support us with all of your positive comments and everything you do in your locations. Thank you so much for being flexible and embracing the new call center. I really appreciate it. This year, the summer reading program had the largest registration that we've had in the past. It was just a really exciting, successful year. Here at Hilliard, we signed up a thousand more children than we had ever done before. And so we had lots of crowds of children coming in and looking for books. And all of the programs, the teen had greater registration as well as the adult. Um, we tried to sign up the adults as soon as the children were signing up and saying, um, model this behavior for your children, um, be a better reader too, and so it was very successful. I really enjoyed the programs that they had, that the librarian set up, um, gave us a lot of good reasons to come to the library. We were here maybe twice a week, and it was fun every time we were here. We got another stack of books, and it's also nice because my girls really like the library, and so then a lot of times we'll take neighbor kids with us, and so it's fun for my girls to be able to share what they like at the library with their friends. Most of us are readers. We know how important and how pleasurable that is, and we want to convey that, whether it's putting good books in an adult's hand or a child's hand. Um, that's, that's the whole reason most of us are here, because we know how important that is. Thank you. The ILS is our basically our foundation for our whole uh, library system. It is our network, uh, so to speak. It has our uh, circulation system. It allows us to do reference. It allows us to order materials. It allows us basically to do everything on our jobs. The, the system that was developed in the late 80s, that's when I started in the library system. And it's been a great system for a number of years. Um, although there are so many newer systems that are Windows based that are a little more user friendly that allow um, more capabilities um, in terms of ordering, um, even circulation, reference. And it was just time for CML to make a change to enhance um, our ability to do our work. It was ex an extremely thorough project. 
um, we covered all of the different aspects of the ILS or all the different aspects of what CML employees do. Um, and it included um, a really nice mix of CML staff across the board at all levels and staff from Worthington and Southwest Public. So it was great to get their take on different things. It's near the end and we're going to have a good um, product and uh, I just want to thank the CML staff for that. It was just a wonderful event. Not only did it provide a, a great teamwork for the staff, but it also just created a great opportunity for our public to come into the library and see the, the Declaration of Independence, a document that many of them had never seen before and they may not ever see again. That was really cool because when we were in Washington, D.C., the National Archives building was closed, and so I finally got to see the Declaration. It was real cool. I got to make the frame, like, hammer the nails into the frame and put the paper in. I remember getting in, there was a lot of people there. Then when we got to see it, uh, they had it in a stand, and there was, like, a glass case thing over it, like, with a glass window that so you could see it. And people were asking questions about it and stuff. It was really cool. The thing is, is that the whole community benefits from having exhibits such as these. Um, they get to see something that they may have never seen in their entire life. In addition, they might make an effort to come down to the main library or come downtown and see something that, see the library that they haven't seen before and realize, wow, this is a great resource that we have. The amazing thing about the Declaration of Independence was how everybody came together to make this happen. It did make it a community event. We had the volunteers as well as all the school children, the adults, and just the library staff. They all came together to really make this event significant, something we'll remember for a long time. Thank you, librarians, for having it all for kids to go see and enjoy. Our new phones are a lot more streamlined, a lot more user friendly than the older ones ever were. It's like upgrading from a Model T to a Lexus. Not only are we turning the page, we're also answering the call. With these new phones, we've basically gotten a total upgrade for the entire system. Transferring calls from one branch location to another has been streamlined. We've also gained the ability for staff voicemail, and the voicemail function for our staff is very easy to use. Through all the changes we've dealt with so far with our new phone system, there have been stressful times with dealing with the new technology. The change was immediate. It was a lot quieter in a number of locations, and numerous branches have sent in thank you cards to Circulate for handling their calls. Undoubtedly, they've had the same thing up here in the reference call center, too. So we send a thank you to everyone that was a part of this team to bring this forth.